winning, winning, winning blueprint, blueprint presents. presents. Five minutes or less. Had so much success with it in the past, I'm coming back to it again. The five minute or less series. This is the schedule release five minute or less series. Welcome. I'm your host, Lou. Thank you for joining me here with the Jacksonville Jaguars. Got five minutes on the clock. Let's get started. So the first thing I like to look at when I look at a schedule is your primetime games. And Jacksonville, we're talking about the Jaguars. This is a team that has really not been in sync over the last seven or eight seasons. And so, you know, primetime games aren't going to be high on the priority list of the NFL for the Jacksonville Jaguars. However, the NFL has put into effect since last year that every team should be on primetime at least once. They've put them on Thursday night football. So now you know the Jacksonville Jaguars are going to have at least one primetime game, and they do. Thursday night, week 14, at home versus the Houston Texans. That's a big game for you. The best team in your division coming to your place on Thursday night football. You have a chance to make a statement. Let's see what the Jacksonville Jaguars do at home Thursday night football week 14 versus the Houston Texans. You look at divisional games and we're talking about the Indianapolis Colts at week four. You got them at home. Got to take care of business in the division at home. You may not be able to get them on the road, but when teams come to your place, you got to find a way to get a win. You got to go to Indy week 17. That's going to be a tough matchup. There's no way around it. At Indy, last game of the season. If they got something to play for, that's going to be a tough environment to win in. You look at Houston. You got the Houston Texans two times in a three-week span. You got them at home in week 14. We just talked about that game. That's the Thursday night matchup, week 14 at home. You look at week 12, you got to go to Houston, and that's going to be a tough matchup again. Best team in your division. How will you respond on the road against the Texans? You look at Tennessee, week 16, at home. So you're looking to finish up your season strong. You got the Titans week 16. What are you going to do at home again? You want to make headway in this division. You got to win your games in the division at home. You're on the road against the Tennessee Titans in week 10. Tough game again on the road. What are you going to do when you go to Tennessee? You look at anomalies and any stretch of games on the schedule where you play three or more straight at home or on the road, three out of four on the road or at home or four out of five at home or on the road is an anomaly for me. And the Jacksonville Jaguars have a huge amount of anomalies on their schedule. It is ridiculous. You look at your home anomaly. You got three straight home games. And anytime you get three straight home games on your schedule, you're going to pay for it some way, some shape, some form on your schedule. They're going to make you pay for that. Week 14, you're home for Houston. Week 15, you're home for Buffalo. Week 16, home for Tennessee. So that's a nice little stretch at the end of the season. However, you're going to pay for that. You have two away anomalies on your schedule. Four out of five. That's the dreaded four out of five. Not many teams have that. You do. Four out of five on the road. Week two at Oakland. Week three at Seattle. Week five at St. Louis. Week six at Denver. That is absolutely brutal. And so you're going to have to find a way to weather the storm early on in the season. Right out of the gate. We're talking weeks two through six. You got four out of five on the road. That's tough. You look at three out of four on the road. Week 10 at Tennessee. Week 12 at Houston. Week 13 at Cleveland. So they gave you three straight at home at one point, but you had to pay for it by having two away anomalies. That's brutal, if you ask me. Week 9 is your bye week. So take advantage of that bye week. Rest your players up. Do what you have to do. You look at a timeout, and every team in the league has a timeout on their schedule. And for me, all the anomalies are the timeout for me. You got one home anomaly, two away anomalies, and the and the one glaring anomaly is the four out of five stretch to start the season out. You got week two on the road, week three on the road, week five on the road, week six on the road. That is what I call absolutely grueling football. You got to find a way to win at least two of those games on the road early in the season and try to get the one sandwiched in between those road matchups at home. If you can get the one at home, and two of those games on the road, you'll win three out of five. You got to feel good about that if you're the Jacksonville Jaguars. And so, you hear that sound in the background. 
And it's coming. That's been the Jacksonville Jaguars. Schedule release in five minutes or less. Five minutes or less.